All right, so here's the thing. Uh, first of all, ranking this discography, and I think these two chuckleheads can, can uh, <laughs> attest to the fact, ranking this discography was incredibly difficult. And by incredibly difficult, since the, the day we decided that we were gonna do the, the review for this or the, the ranking for this, my numbers have switched back and forth nonstop as to what was the greatest. And we all know what the worst was, we'll get there. Even in the car ride over here, I had a rough time ranking these albums. This is my number six. And, and God, no, look, no bueno, look, no bueno, <laughs> no bueno, <laughs> no bueno. I, I understand, and I... Do you? I, you think I, you know I, someone, maybe. right? Maybe. Be, be, I mean, the, there are just things that beat it out. I had no f***ing choice. I've been back and forth. Five and other things beat out Altars of Madness. Five other things beat out Altars of Madness. So, so again, I'm, I'm sorry that this is lower on the list, but they have too many kick-ass albums. What do you want? Higher ranking. Yeah, higher ranking for yeah. sure. Yeah. <laughs> what a fucking butthole. All right. <laughs> Woo, you know he did. You're welcome, but I mean, it sucks to rank this just like it sucked to rank Testament. You know, just, man. How bad did it suck to rank Morbid Angel? Pretty bad. <laughs> Let, let's be honest here. It, it, it's, it's always going to be there. Cheers. Cheers, buddy. You bastard. All right. All just of madness <laughs> equals John sadness. <laughs> we love the rhyme scheme. I hate you both. I want so that on much. a t-shirt. I want that on a t-shirt. Yeah, there you go. You should make it. Another excellent member of the community, Mr. Sharup Pathur, says, "Altars of Madness." Versus Rain and Blood. Now, obviously, Jam and John doesn't have Altars of Madness rated very high, so I have a feeling he'll probably go Jesus Rain and Christ. Blood. <laughs> Number six overall. Can you believe it? Uh, Never forget. <laughs> but first as, of all, fuck these guys. Second of all, fuck these guys. Never. Forget. Um. Never forget. Third of all, this one's this one might be the hardest one so far. Yeah. I'm gonna go Altars of Madness. I, oh, you would. I, 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 You've got a reputation to yeah. save, don't you? <laughs> Fourth of all, fuck these guys. They'll never live it down. Um, we won't let them. <laughs> we have Cannibal Corpses eaten back to life versus Morbid Angels Altar of Madness. Altars of Madness. Altars. Altars of Madness. Altars. Yeah, yeah, Altars it's of Altars. Madness. Uh, I mean, that was my first Cannibal Corpse album, but I mean, Altars is Altars amazing. Is Certainly not number six on my list, that's for damn sure. <sighs> there we go. Mm. <laughs> All right, next we have Havoc. Time is... Everything about this album, from the sound of it to the riffs and the creativity behind them is just super influential. And for a debut album, it's hard to kick ass on a debut album like this. Uh, Morbid Angel does it, though, right, John? <laughs> <laughs> and Subtle barb. I, I, You'll live it down one of these I days. think this Bye. is a gem of the entire metal spectrum. Obviously, these two guys hate this album. Uh, I don't know why, because it's such a great album. I just don't understand why it's not your favorite. That's certainly not number Both six. Definitely not number six. Jesus though. Christ. <laughs> <laughs> and that I'm trying was, to see what you're saying. And that was a takeaway. I, he lost me in Baroness. Uh, he, <laughs> I, that's a hard right. I, yeah. I'm, I disagree. I disagree. That's what I heard. What do you guys think? Tell us in the comments below if you agree or disagree. Yeah, feel free to uh, comment. I'm sure you will. Yeah. <laughs> I'm, I'm commenting in my head right now. It's altars all over again, man. <laughs> it always comes back to that. Dude, <laughs> dude, it came out when we were talking to him in force. Yeah, dude. It was like, yeah, wait, didn't you have, like, altars? Like, no, dude, they called him on it. It was like, that's just, really? The lead singer agreed with me. <sighs> he was being nice. He was being nice. <laughs> <laughs> Remember that time Jam and John ranked Altars of Madness at number six? What the hell was he thinking? You're you're not a patriot if you rank <laughs> Altars of Madness at number I don't, six. I don't why why, why don't you done. tell me? Huh? 
it almost works as like a sequel to God of Emptiness, but that is a god, and there are no gods before this band right now, so can't necessarily god be that one. God of Emptiness. Who does? Morbid Angel. Didn't we do that discography we ranking did before? did do that one. We did. Yeah. They have a killer debut album. Oh my what god, it's called? amazing, isn't it? Oh yeah. Oh, Altars of Madness. John, have you ever right. heard it? I hate both of them. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> He'll be fine. He'll be fine. He'll cry it out. Nothing? Everybody. <laughs> Everybody makes mistakes. As long as you're willing to admit that was a mistake. You know what? I, there, there are, it's it, true. There are so many. I wish I could go back, but I can't. It's on the internet already, so whatever. Forever. But and we will remind him if he ever forgets. Do you, you remind me? Fucking the fans remind me. Thank that, you. Dude, Thank when, you all. When we, we ran Thank into that all. dude at uh, Deicide, he reminded me. Yeah. Who was fucking the dude at Deicide? Yep. You're dude, right. Enforced reminded me. <laughs> yeah, dude. It's, it's whatever. It happens. I mean, it is one of the greatest the, debut metal albums. I mean, it, legit. It, it, uh, <laughs> I might listen to it later. In spite. Are we doing something? Yes. yes. Sorry, we're we doing do something. Anyway, Jesus 